which they had left behind on the signpost. How will we go home? he said. Then, as the dancers passed by once more, Mr. Brolly opened his umbrella, and Mrs. Brolly reached out and took Harry's hand, and so they went, floating up together, and followed by Wilkins, the little cloud, the camera, and the trunks. Harry awoke beneath his patchwork quilt. Outside, the day was grey, but the sunshine was making its way through the clouds. In the shaft of light, Harry could see what he thought were two large birds winging their way towards him. But as they drew near, he saw that they were not birds, but the lost umbrellas making their way home. Quack, they said as they flew. Quack. Enjoy, enjoy programs like the Brollies. Watch this. A one, two, a one, two, three. So, what do you fancy doing today, then, Chester? Well, I'm feeling a bit artistic, so I thought I might try making something. What about a bit of drawing? Yeah, brilliant! And then I'd like to hear some really great stories, because I'm not very good at reading yet. OK, then, and in the afternoon, we can have a few jokes, can't we? A bit of a laugh, can't we? <laughs> yeah, and get some of our friends round, and then we can play some music. And you mustn't forget to help me look after the pets. Well, you can do all of those things just by watching Children's BBC. Every day? Every day? Wow! I'm off then! Hang on, hang on. Wait for me. Great programmes for younger children are on every morning and lunchtime on Children's BBC, so don't miss them. Children's BBC, the best children's broadcasting there is. Ah! Was that all right? Was that all right? It was perfectly correct, Chester. The best children's broadcasting there is, and you are privileged enough to be watching it. What on earth? Coming shortly, but now, Bodger and Badger. Chocolate on the windowsill. That's what they said. Weird potatoes. Phew. Twist. 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 Oh, bust. Well, I did it. Great work, Badge. Now, yeah, please, what's going on? Well, you remember that bowl of chocolate we had yesterday? Yeah. yeah that Bogey confiscated. I thought she ate it. She did. And teachers aren't supposed to eat things they confiscate, so we thought we'd pay her back. What, by giving her another bar of chocolate? We yeah. didn't show you the wrapper, did we, Badge? See? Oh, Chocolax, for the after lunch ever lunch. What's that mean? Well, it's the sort of chocolate that people buy when yeah. they want to go, but they can't. Go where? You know. <laughs> oh, I see! Only <laughs> with this stuff, you don't just go, you gallop. <laughs> oh, pooey. Simon Bodger? Yeah? Oh, thanks. For whatever it is. 
What? Oh, brushes. That's great. I could really do with some good strong. Here. These are molten. Oi. Oh. Oi. Oh, well done, Simon. Did you hear me coming? Miss Spoon, you've, wow. you've got a baby. That's right. But you never said that. I, I mean, no one said you were going to have it. Congratulations. Oh! <laughs> it's not my baby, Simon. Oh. No, it's my next door neighbours. Oh, I see. Yes, I've just been looking after Mary for the day. Oh. Isn't she sweet? Oh, ever so. Oh. Oh. Wind. Wind? Mm. Oh, there you are, Miss Mona. What's that? Oh, I was just coming to explain. No need. I'm sorry, but you're far too young to come to my school. Children start here when they're five years old, not five months old. Now, is that understood? Oh, oh wind. wind. Wind? Wind. You see, headmistress, my next-door neighbour suddenly had to fly off to Scotland very suddenly, and I've always wanted to look after little Mary. And she's never let me before, so if you don't mind, headmistress... There you are. Scriggles. <laughs> oh, quickly. Class time already. <laughs> Come along, Mary. <laughs> <laughs> Babies are bad enough. Then they get worse. Good morning, children. Now, 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 back, back to your desks, everyone, please. Get back, shh, 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 shh. Get back, 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 please. Thank you. Where would I be? Now, I don't want you all rushing up and scaring her, but in a minute, you'll all have a chance to say, Hello, Mary. Hello, Mary. <laughs> That's right, Mary. <laughs> did she... Did she just say, Hello, Mary? Yes! Oh, that's, right. Right. that's incredible. She's not supposed to be able to talk yet. I wonder if she can say anything else. My name is Miss Moon. Can you say Miss Moon? <laughs> <laughs> well, almost. She must be rather tired by now. Yeah, exhausted. <laughs> yes, I'm sure you are. Uh, what she did again? Oh, oh, just wait till I go ahead, mistress. Now, um, children, you just stay here in your seats for two ticks while I dash out and tell her. Oh, pokey nose. Yes. No, Mary. No. That is not what we call Mrs. Bogart, the headmistress. <laughs> and I am sure you didn't learn that from me. Right. What have we got in the confiscation box today? Wrappers? I don't want wrappers. I want chucky. You never guess what, headmistress. Don't you knock. Oh. It's about little Mary, and Mrs. She can talk. Oh, really? What does she say? G -g -g or just eh, eh, eh. No, actual words. She says, hello, Mary, and exhausted, and who, bogey... Well, anyway, she can talk. Now, come along, Mary. Say something to the headmistress. Mmm, oh. fascinating. She did, honestly, she really did. Yes, and I've got fairies at the bottom of my garden. Have you, headmistress? Oh, go away and teach something. Oh, sorry, headmistress, right. Well, come along, Mary. Super Califrat. Baby, please. please. Miss Moon! Yes? I wouldn't mind looking after it. <laughs> Mary, for a bit. Oh, really, headmistress? I, I thought you didn't like babies. Babies? Love them. I was one myself, once. <laughs> <laughs> no, you run along, Miss Wood. Bye. Oh, oh, all right, then. All right. But then if she starts talking again... Oh, yes, I'll come running straight over to tell you. All right. Goodbye, Mary. Oh, can you say goodbye? Goodbye! Did you hear that? Goodbye, Miss Moon. Right, Mary. Right, now, you don't mind if I help myself, do you? Just as well. Let's see what we've got in here, please. Let it all be chockies. Juice? Nope. Rusks? Yuck. Puree? Forget it. I don't want this mimsy muck. I want chock... chocky... Ch chocky. Oh. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh. Do you like Chucky Mary? You do? Well, so do I. Mmm. Haven't had this one before. You want some? You do? Tough. Unusual. But nice. Very nice. Very, very nice. Woo. Woo, dear. Well, I think I've just got to, uh, 
I'll be right back. Ah, oh, that's better, isn't it? Oh, well done, Badge. Oh, you stopped the baby crying. Well, it's not worth crying, is it, mate? No, of course not. But I know what you want. Hello, Mary. Here you are. Oh, a rattle. That's a rattling good idea, Badge. Oh, I know. Here you are, then. There. Yeah. Now, she can play with that all day, look. Oh, oh good, it. Now, Badger might think it's funny to throw rattles out of prams, but really, you see... Here you are. Wait, 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 Badger. Wait, 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 wait! What? Now, listen, Mary. You aren't going to throw this rattle, are you? No, 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 you aren't going to... A Badger! Sorry. Just give it to Mary, right? Right. There you go. That's it. Right. Now. That's it. Now, no thanks to you, Badger. I finally taught Mary not to throw rattles out of her... Oh! <laughs> Badger? Sorry. All good. It. Tell you what we'll do. Tell you what we'll do. Mary, I'm going to take you downstairs and show you the workshop. Mm. That's it. Up you come. There's a good girl. You coming, Badger? Badger? Oh, he's popping <coughs> out of the room, Mary, to the workshop. You come with me. That's it. <laughs> Just wanted to try out being a baby. That's it. <laughs> Very nice too. It's all right being a baby, isn't it? Plenty of grub, have a kip when you feel like it. No work to do all day. Easy potatoes. Oh, blimey. The break time, bell. Better make a move, I suppose. Cool. Shame, really. It's nice being a little tiny. How is she here, mistress? Uh -huh. Mary. Hey. Hey, mistress! Head mistress! Head mistress! Oh, where can she be? Yeah. Where? Oh, there! Can you come out quickly? Oh, what's the matter with you? Oh, can't you see? I'm trying to. For heaven's sake, now, now what is it? It's Mary. She's gone hairy. Hairy? Mary! Just come and see. Oh, for goodness sake, can't even get a poo in peace round here. Never mind, never mind. Right, let's take a look at this bearded baby, shall we? Bearded yes. baby? Well, look, she... It's completely disappeared. Just like your brain. But... Sometimes, Miss Moon, I oh. could quite happily... Oh. oh, dear, what's wrong? Nothing, I... I've just got to, uh... Ooh. 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 Oh... It was so scary, Simon. Scary? Mary went hairy. Hairy? Hairy. What, Mary? Hairy, scary Mary. Oh, uh, hairy, scary... What sort of hairy? All black and white hairy? Badger. Badger? Oh, badger, badger. Badger, you were surprised. Oh, it was hair-raising. Perhaps I gave her her feet at the wrong time. I must have done something. Anyway, her mother says she's going to phone as soon as she gets to Scotland. Hey, you're not going to tell her about this, are you? I'll have to. Knowing her, she'll get the first plane back and never let me look after Mary again. Really? Never, ever again, Mary. Oh. Oh, dear. Perhaps I gave her too much talcum powder. Or perhaps you just imagined Mary being hairy. Oh, I'm sure I didn't. But say you saw everybody go hairy. Well, no one has gone hairy except for Mary. Not yet, they haven't. Oh. What? Uh, nothing. See you in a bit. Bye. See you, Mary. Yeah. Oh. Pooey potatoes. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I never seen old bogey nose run so fast. <laughs> Will I get there in time? Yeah. <laughs> I'll see him do it twice. So far. Yeah. <laughs> beards. Everyone's got to have false beards. Why? I can't explain now, but how do you make false beards? I know. Oh, they sent them to the drug shop. No, too expensive, Rocky. I've got to have everybody wearing. No, what are you doing? What are you doing? Look, you're bashing all the bristles out of this brush badger. Oh, no. Hey. Oh, I get it. What? The, the bristles. bristles. Bristles? Oh, the bristles. Right. Only thing is, what are we going to stick these false bristles on with, eh? 
Oh no. Uh, oh no, Badger, no, Badger, not mashed potato, not again. Why not? I know mashed potato is very useful stuff, Badger, but there's no way you can use it to stick full spears on, Badger. Look, what are you doing? No, no, Badger, no, 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 Badger, no, stop, no, Badger, Badger, get off, Badger, get off. Look, for goodness sake, Vicky, stop doing that, Vicky, Rocky, stop doing that. Look. Come on, oh. ring, ring, Mary's mummy, why don't you? Ah, oh, come on. Hello? Oh, scriggles. In the flipping break time bell. Well, come along, Mary. Let's go and meet Ashley and Victoria and Gemma and Louise and Lisa and Louisa and... Here she comes. Mark and Tony and Vicky and Rocky and Junior. Something wrong, miss. You've all grown beards. Of course we haven't, have we? No. I think Missy must be imagining it. Imagining it? <laughs> Miss Moon? Yes? I was wondering if... Simon, you've got a beard too. No, I haven't, Miss Moon. Yes, you have, just like the children. Eh? They haven't got beards. Yes, they have. <laughs> oh. But they had... Beards just like yours. Oh. Oh, imagining it. The phone's ringing in the office. Ah, Mary's mother. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> oh, thank you, Simon. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, everybody. You can find your beards in his bag. <laughs> Hello. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Oh, yes, fine, fine. Oh, Mary, yes, she's wonderful. Say hello to Mummy, Mary. Oh, well, yes, she's fine. We'll bring her round this evening. Bye. Everything all right, miss? Yes, everything's fine. Mm. Mary's lost her beard. You've lost yours. <coughs> I must have imagined the whole hairy experience. Well, that's an explanation I can think of. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Oh. Oh, me and all. What? Badger. What? Mr. Badger, do you realise we have completely run out of toilet... Whoa! Paper? <laughs> <laughs> Did she imagine the beard? Do you think it suits me? It's a bit bristly, actually. <laughs> Very handy for clearing up the mess that Ed and Andy make, though. Don't you think? Oh, I've made the arrow go all wobbly. How very exciting. Lots coming up still this afternoon. Just before What on Earth, I'll tell you the legend of Prince Valiant is following it. I'm afraid what? Well, at least for you. Bad news? Here, you better read it yourself. What am I going to do? Ah, oh, hello, you two. I'm glad you've arrived together. I've been thinking. Oh, my, did you hear that, Sean? Mum's been thinking. Thinking? Mum, my flabber's completely ghasted. Oh, very droll. Here, Mum, sit down. Here, yeah, have a seat. Now, do you want to hear or not? We're prepared. What was this great thought? It's about Oliver's visit. Over to you, little mother. No, it concerns you too, Zoe. Oh? Hmm. Your room's slightly bigger than Sean's, and the spare bed's in there, so I just They're not having my room. It's only for a short Mom, time. Mum, no. Honestly, my room's big enough. Oliver and I will manage okay. Great start to the summer holidays this is. Now just calm down, Zoe, and let's talk this over quietly. 